Uh, I've been asked this question. It was, uh, uh, what is it? Sam Haq has asked me that, look, can I give some few words on advice towards learning? Uh, if you want to learn something and things like this, how, how should you do it? Like a topic or you want to research or increase your... Look, some quick words. People learning, this is my advice, that it must take place as a proactive step. You know, a lot of my learning, a lot of it, is actually not through a one book. Like, I, you know, sometimes I speak about things and people will say, oh, can you recommend a book on this measure, on this topic? Like when I spoke on the Petra thing, or when I spoke on uh, gem demonic possessions, or when I spoke on magic, or on the second coming of Jesus, or when I spoke on, on many things on Bukhari Gate, or I spoke on uh, all these kind of things, people will say, oh, can you tell me a book to read? Like they assume, that like, let's say this is a book here, they assume that this book will have, like, it will have all the answers. Like, I just need to read this book passively and I will then learn. And I'm telling you, that's not, that's not how I learn anyway. I seldom go through, like, when I'm learning a topic, go through a book cover to cover, seldom. What I do is I just research the hell out of stuff and it's active learning. So what I'll do is like I'll begin with like I want to learn about something. I don't know. Like let's say I want to learn about um, like let's say I want to learn about psychology. I, I don't know about psychology. I want to learn about it. So I'll begin by just actually searching what is psychology and I'll watch an introduction, I'll read something basic, it may not have accurate information in it, I might just read Wikipedia, and it'll say like, oh, this splits off into different fields, it splits into psychodynamics, I'll be like, oh, what psychodynamics? I'll click that. Oh, psychodynamics is this field that deals with the, the, the kind of unconscious uh, elements, uh, it's been pioneered by people like Freud, I'll be like, oh, who's Freud? I'll go into that. Now I'll start, Freud, he, he's this pioneering figure who appears in the 18th, 19th century. He's somebody who kind of uh, puts forward the, the whole concept of the unconscious. He's, uh, uh, he speaks about the ego, the id. Oh, what's the id? And I'll start reading the id. Oh, how does this, hmm. So is the, is the id, uh, is the id the dominant kind of, uh, consciousness that we let me google this is this hmm, what are these what are these articles saying what's this chat saying hmm did Fre hmm Freud seems to be you know there seems to be a bit of an overlap he, uh, did he take some of his ideas from hypnosis let me research this hmm oh what does young young who's young oh he says Carl Jung says this oh right how does psycho how does Carl Jungian psychoanalysis differ from Freudian Right, okay, what is this shadow? And I just search and search and search the hell out of stuff. And that's, and then that's how I just learn. And I'll like watch things, then I'll be like, oh, that's fascinating. I listen to a whole lecture based on this and I'll go through something on YouTube and then I'll find some professors and start reading up on some of their things, go through some audio books and meanwhile, and I'll have like, I'll have like, 30 pages open on my <laughs> Google Chrome of different things that I and I'll go on script and I'll search what what was this or what was and I'll find certain articles and I'll just read small articles and and then I'll go off on another little search and and I'm telling you you know this way of learning in two weeks you will know more than people who've just read like three four books from cover to cover or people that have even studied that topic for like maybe two years but just passively studied it i honestly feel that you because it's the proactive kind of curiosity the inconquerable unquenchable thirst that you bring to the table it's it's it opens pathways or as uh, our <laughs> in the earlier meme he said the opening <laughs> So the back opening, you know, the back opening. <laughs> so this one, top opening, you know, cognitive opening. So people, 